Question 2B. A farmer wishes to enclose a rectangular plot with a wire fence. The width of the plot is 3 meters less than its length. L. Alright. Given that the area enclosed by the fence is 378 square meters. That's the area enclosed by the fence. Show that L squared minus 3L minus 278 is equal to 0. Hmm. Let's see now. It's a rectangular plot with a wire fence. The width of the plot is 3 meters less than its length, L. Let's um, see if we can make a visual representation of this. With a question like this, it's usually very good idea to make a visual representation All right now let's see if we can make a sketch of what it might look like might look like say this is the plot and the width of the plot is three meters less than its length l Let's call across here the width. All right. So this is width, and up here the length. Up and down as the length. So the length is L. All the way from here to here is L. The width. Is 3 meters less so the width now is 3 meters less than its length if its length was 10 the width would be 7 which is 10 minus 3 if the length was 20 the width would be 20 minus 3 which is 17 and so on so the width is L minus 3 so let's call this length this width L minus 3 is from here to here is L minus 3 all right now the area enclosed by the fence is 378 square meters all right so let me just erase part of this so this width here is L minus 3 all right now by the fence remember that is a rectangular plot it enclosed with a wire fence so these four lines would be like the fence you're looking at and the area is 378 square meters so what this is really saying is that the length multiplied by the width which is L minus 3 you have to put it in brackets so the length times the width length times L minus 3 is equal to 378 alright L is the length, you know, and I'm really saying L the length times the width, which is L minus 3. So you know that it's a rectangle, so this is the way you multi you um calculate the area. So now L times L gives you L squared minus L times 3 is a 3L is equal to 378 and if you subtract 378 from both sides you get L squared minus 3L minus 378 equals 0 right now just before I end 
let me just remind you again you should only look at these videos if you've already done most of the work and you are taking the exam in the next sitting don't look at this these videos if you're in grade 7 to 10 or 2 to 9 7 to 9 or if you are in first second third or a third form all right if you're in fourth form and you plan to sit the exam in may no problem you can look at these videos after and only after you do your best to work out the, the questions if you're in fifth form or grade 11 and you're going to sit the exam next year you can look at them only after you complete or you are only after you've tried these questions or if you have already sat the exam if you did not pass and you plan to do the reset in January or in May all right so ensure that you try these questions before you actually look through these past papers and the past paper is just a guide remember these are not the exact same questions that are going to come in the next exam and what is important is that you understand the principles behind the work that is done in completing these questions all right so later on